Hello and welcome to the customer success video series. In this quick session we will walk through the new Remedy Force chat capability. Why should you consider using chat? Most service desks today leverage multiple channels to interact between IT and their supported users. Phone and email are the most popular channels and a lot of organizations are starting to leverage self-service capabilities. Chat extends that self-service and allows client users a new communication method to quickly access support for their issues and questions. Third-party research has shown that chat lowers the cost per ticket and increases the perceived effectiveness of the service desk by providing a real-time interaction with IT. Here are some of the key features with Remedy Force Chat. You can control who sees and can access chat. You can have the user select from a set of predefined categories to route the chat session to an expert support staff member or queue. Alternatively, you can have the chat sessions automatically round robin based assign out to staff members that are available for chat. Chat sessions can be associated to an existing or a new incident. And we have provided out of the box dashboard for evaluating chat effectiveness and abandon rate. As you plan to implement chat, you can follow these easy steps to enable chat in your Remedy Force system. You will enable the chat feature in the Remedy Force Administration tab and decide which accounts will have access to chat. Many Remedy Force customers tend to pilot features like chat with a smaller subset of the business to evaluate any challenges they need to prepare for before rolling it out to the broader organization. Next, you will determine if you want to leverage the category-based assignment through the pre-chat form. If you use the pre-chat form, you will then decide and enable the categories that will be used and the support individuals or queues that support those categories. The last configuration will be to expose chat in the Remedy Force console for staff members that participate. In the self-service portal, the chat form can be accessed in the lower right-hand corner. This is how it will look to client users when the pre-chat form is enabled. The client and staff chat windows are consistent and intuitive to use. Clients have the ability to add attachments to the chat session by clicking on the paperclip icon. Once the chat session is over, the staff member can create a new incident or add to an existing incident. In the Remedy Force chat dashboard, users can view metrics to evaluate chat effectiveness. Users can review possible issues with abandoned sessions to determine the optimal staffing model. They can also understand chat duration for staff planning. Thank you for watching this video. If you have additional questions about Remedy Force, please contact your CSM or email remedyforcesuccess at bmc.com.